If you're in the market for new tennis shoes at a very, very attractive price point, stay tuned because I'm going to introduce the Fitville Amadeus tennis shoe to you. And let me tell you, I'm really excited about this shoe. So let's get started with the unboxing. So I've got two pairs here, different colors of the Fitville Amadeus tennis shoe. And I've been wearing another pair for about three, four weeks. So I can absolutely tell you how the shoe's behaving after you played with it for a while. Even though I know what's in there, I'm always excited when I'm getting to unboxing new things. So this is the Fitville Amadeus in avocado green gray. And then I have the Amadeus in just regular white and light blue. Let's talk about the features. And it, I don't know if it was serendipity, I don't know what it was, but Fitville contacted me and I was wondering how on earth they would know that I actually have flat feet and I've been struggling with plantar fasciitis my entire career. So the absolute number one feature for me of these shoes is that they are having wider toe boxes. This shoe has a wider toe box and it fits really, really well. You can get them in wide, you can get them in extra wide. So no matter what size or shape your foot is, you will have the perfect fit. I've struggled to find a shoe ever since two other companies actually discontinued the respective model that I was able to wear to find a shoe that fits right from the get-go in all parts of the foot. So usually I had to go up half a size or maybe even a whole size to accommodate my wider foot. These are wide, extra wide, you're good to go. And they fit from the get-go. The upper outer layer here is leather, really breathable. I've played with another pair for about three weeks and I feel that I don't have to haul the shoe off immediately when I step off court. So that's always a really good sign. So I've mentioned plantar fasciitis and I'm sure that there's a lot of players out there that struggle with this issue. These shoes will really help you stabilize sideways. They are torsion resistant, so they're not flimsy at all. They're super stable in that they don't twist easily, yet they're not heavy. And when I first put them on, I was actually surprised how really sturdy and supportive they felt, yet really light. So you don't feel like you're lugging around five pounds per foot. So this is the pair that I've been wearing for three to four weeks now. And usually by the time that I'm at three to four weeks, you will see a very distinct shaving off here. And what I really do like is that the upper protection here goes a lot further around than in other models of shoes and it comes up higher because I'm actually dragging my feet quite a bit when I'm hitting forehands and actually on the backhand slice. So they are still in really good shape. So now let's look at the soles. I'm out on court about five, six hours a day, six days a week, and I play in. I'm not just standing around there. So this, comparatively to other shoes that I've worn, is very little use. And I do like that because I don't wanna to have to buy new shoes every other month or then also have to throw them out. Let's keep them out of the landfills. And yeah, I'm really surprised how good they're holding up with as much stress as I'm putting on them. The insole is shock absorbent. It has an extra little race right here where usually your arch really comes down when you pound on your feet when you're running a lot. So that's an extra support. That's an extra feature though that I'm not gonna use because I have custom made insoles. And I am also very happy that these shoes actually allow me to wear my insoles because they fit. With other models, Again, I had to get up half a size or even a full size to accommodate my insoles because otherwise they wouldn't fit. And then of course, if you're going up half a size, full size for one feature of your foot, it's not gonna fit in another way. And I have not felt that with this shoe here. So just from taking it out of the box the very first time and putting it on, I was really excited to then try it on the court. So for a lot of players, it's the price point that is the make or break of whether they're gonna buy the shoe or not. And this shoe has a great price point. And if you use the link that I'm gonna put into the description down below, you're saving an additional 18%. Usually when you're getting new shoes, you would probably not wanna wear them at the very beginning of a match. With these shoes, 
I feel I can do whatever I want without having to worry about getting blisters. They're sturdy, but they're still very soft. And because of the features that it has, the wider toe boxes, the stronger arch support, I feel I can start playing right away without having to worry about anything. So let's see how I'm hitting with them. So what's the conclusion I have about the Fitvale tennis shoes? Love them. Point blank, love them. In the beginning, I was a little curious about why a company would try to break into the tennis shoe market because it feels kind of saturated, to be honest. But, but, after having worn a pair now for three weeks, I had no issues whatsoever with having a great fit there for the wider foot that I have. Plantar fasciitis, absolutely no topic in this shoe because it's super stable, it's very supportive, especially on the lateral movement. And yeah, one other thing that I really love is I don't have to buy a new shoe every month. It doesn't break the bank. And again, remember if you use my link down below, you get 18% off. I keep things out of the landfills. And the best thing is I feel I don't have to break them in. They fit perfectly right from the get-go. So I'm telling you, these are fantastic shoes and you should give them a go.